freaking good. That's her thing, looking freaking good. How did you expect her to look? I don't know. Like, she had spent the last year binging on Ben and Jerry's. Like, like she had had cosmetic surgery by a blind man. What can I say? I wanted her to look like shit. Oh, that's nice. With stringy hair and sunken cheeks like death. Uh, a soccer mom who's hooked on crystal meth. Right. Decaying bit by bit like shit. Oh, uh, that certainly sounds realistic. Realism has got nothing to do with it. I wanted her to have a flaw. Like a claw? Yeah, a goiter like a bus or a grin with gaps. I wanted her to glance my way and collapse. Weeping in her double knit. Oh, I wanted her to look like shit. But when she walked into the room, she was wind blown and calm. A heavenly confection of preppy a plum. And she said, How are you, Henry? Isn't this bizarre? Then she kissed me on the cheek and kindly nodded at Tamar and said, we flew in from the coast. Oh, weddings are a bore. Did you hear that I was pregnant? Did you say hello to Thor? He's a pilot. He's in men's up place championship croquet. Last year, he was Google's Mr. May. Oh, my. So good to see you, Henry. How grand to say hello. I forgot this is the spot where you proposed, and I said, no. Are you living in your walk-up? I may still have the key. Talk about your music. Is your name on a marquee? What can you do? I always knew without me you'd be debris. So sorry that I couldn't commit. She couldn't and commit. And I'm sorry I don't look like shit. Like shit, like shit, like shit. You thought I'd be a blimp, will bite your tongue. Daily sex keeps a lay. Young, never felt more firm and fit. Far from shit. Far from shit. And she really said all of that? Oh, yeah. And later on, she cornered me by the cake table. I love your lady Henry, so strikingly risque. So witty, and she's pretty in an ethnic sort of way. Do you think she understands you? You're refreshingly unique. Tell me what's the deal behind her villagey mystique. All I know is that Henry, oh, for God's sake, lose the streak. Ouch. You look like a banana split, but me, I'll never look like shit. Dude, I gotta come clean with you. Dream Sheila. She's got a point. What? You don't like my new look? <laughs> like, what I think doesn't matter. What matters is that Sheila would have hated it. I mean, don't you see the two of you never would have been happy? Yeah, I guess so. Henry, I just got off the phone with Broadway World. They're going to cover your reading at 54 Below. <laughs> That's great, Sheila. Tamar! I mean Tamar. It's you I love. You know that, right? Oh, what's going on here? Uh, Henry had a little... Dream. A nightmare. I was at Sheila's wedding. You had a dream about your ex almost wedding. Yeah, but it wasn't like that. She was marrying the Google guy, not me. Well, so. that's a relief. Right. It doesn't matter. What does is that I love you. I love you too. <laughs> but Sheila obviously meant so much to you, Henry. I mean, you're even dreaming about her. She's still this mosquito buzzing around your head. There. Killed it. Forget Sheila. On second thought, she looked like shit. Sheila? That's sort of sweet. <laughs> She's a cross between an Ewok and Chairman Mao. She's got a lazy eye and a unibrow. Oh, dude, that's the other one. Oh, yeah, right. Keep going, I like this. She definitely looked like shit. Yeah, she looked like Who cares if she was fit? What matters is she's gone now. Right up her obit. I'm moving on now. Moving on now, go. Don't mind me finish your show. Let the good times accrue. And if you see her again, and she acts out to you, there's a thing you can say that is strictly legit. 
You know what, babe? You look like shit. 